It is Manchester United 2, Man City 1, Manchester United collecting 3 points. Manchester is red, baby. Yes, indeed. Manchester is red. Manchester United picking up those three points in the second half, especially after the shambolic start to the second half where Manchester United will just be impressed. Staying in their own box. Possession of Manchester City. And then for them to score that goal. But before we even get there, guys, I am so damn happy. I'm happy to the fact that Manchester is red. We've got a revenge and especially... Beating City, becoming one point behind them, you know. And they're probably going to say, is the title race on now? You know, we're not far from Arsenal, but let's not let's not get ourselves carried away. We'll just, let's, let's just catch up in points. But it is what it is. Uh, brilliant so far in the first half overall, because overall in that first 45 minutes, Manchester United were looking good because City themselves were making mistakes. Mistakes, passing the ball off the pitch. Something that Manchester United used to do back then when we used to pass the ball off the pitch for throw-ones and give them away to the opposition. But City were the one that were doing it in the first 45 minutes. Mark Strasher with a chance there, breaking away, but not able to convert it into the back of the net. When he got injured, I was like, oh my God, please, Rashford, please make it, make it. He got up in the second half. I was hearing that Anthony was getting ready um, in, in the half time in the warm up and I'm thinking, yeah, Rashford is out, Rashford is out. But it was Martial who came off. Again, in that second half, which was a great second half for, for me in the last 10 minutes, 15 minutes, but in the first 20 minutes, we was shit. We was dominated possession by Manchester City. Manchester City was that goal, Grealish. Grealish coming on, making a difference. De Bruyne as well with a wonderful cross. Beating Casemiro as well. And then, of course, finding Grealish with, Grealish with that nice header. And it was 1-0 to Shitty. And I was pissed. I was feeling like shit. I'm like, Shitty, you're making me feel like shit. My God. And I was sonic because I didn't deserve it. But again, Bruno Fernandes. Bruno Fernandes coming back. Um, you know, it was a controversial goal with Rashford offside, but not interfering with play. You know, big up the referee from getting that right. Bruno finishing it well. And it was 1-1. Oh, we was ecstatic. We was like, we are back. And I was thinking to myself, we can come back. We can win, guys. We we definitely can win. Yeah, mm -hmm, we can win. And that's what we did. Good night, Cho. You know, Man City, you had your Grealish. You had your G. But we had our G. And that guy's name is called Alejandro Garnacho. And oh, my God. He done some G shit, bruv. He went past some players. Flopped at the first time. And then at the second attempt, finding Rashford for that tap in and Rashford scoring his seventh consecutive goal, his sixteenth goal, and as well equaling um Ruth Van Nistel to be the first Manchester United player to score seven consecutive goals. And then of course Manchester United fight for their life, defending for their life, all over the pitch, making changes as well, winning headers, but Manchester United made it 2-1 full time and we was ecstatic, finally happy. Getting our revenge. Manchester is red. And I'm happy about that. Players today's was good. Rashford made a difference in that second of Casemiro. Big up Casemiro as well, man. Such a player. Such a baller. Ericsson, okay today. Picked up some lovely passes as well. But then again, got blocked. Fred. <laughs> Pastor Frederick did what he had to do. Garnacho coming on, making a difference. Bruno Fernandes, man, the match display for me. Um, Luke Shaw did so well in defence with Varane, wonderful. Um, Aaron Wan-Bissaka was doing some stuff that I couldn't believe. His first touches was improving, his dribbling was improving as well. So, big up to him as well and Melassi as well. But the team did good. Man, the match today has to go to Bruno Fernandes, my guy. Yes, Bruno, big up to you, captain. Everything, we look like a team indeed. That's what he said at, at full time. Don't get the match with no one, nobody. Message to Manchester United fans, we're taking it one game at a time. Tranquille, come to our calm down. We Manchester is red. As always, guys, remember to follow the accounts as well. Make sure you, you smash the like button. Make sure you subscribe. And, of course, share across all notes, um, social media accounts and press that notification bell to be the first to watch. Because this has been your match reaction from your boy, Ivor Inspector. Enjoy his Saturday. All day is going to be, oh, I'm so happy. As always, guys, as well, let me know what your thoughts are in the comments. Let me know who your man the match is. Let me know who your donkey of the match is. And as always, remember to keep it united and remember to keep it red united. And we'll see you on Monday on Instagram for the catch up. Peace! We winners, baby! Peace!
Peace, peace, peace. Love you guys. Manchester Red. <laughs>